about Sonny? Yeah, I heard. How come you didn't get caught? I'm trying to avoid the police and those type of people. I haven't seen Sonny for a long time. It's been over a year. I don't know what to do to help him. Uh, there's really nothing you can do to help him now. So what have you been up to? Not much, not much. Not much. I, I, I thought Sonny was smart. I, smart like you, math teacher from the ghetto. Man, if I was smart, you would reach for a gun a long time ago. Alright, I'll see ya. Here's the money. Dude. It's the police! Uh, oh it's no, the popo! I gotta bounce! This pal, come ah. back! Ah. Going to jail for a long time. You have the right to remain silent, and anything you say will be used against you. Dear James, I wanted to write you many a time, but I dug how much I would have hurt you, so I didn't write. But now I feel like a man who's been trying to climb up out of a deep hole and just saw the sun outside. I gotta get outside. I can't tell you much about how I got here. I mean, like, honestly, I don't know how to tell you. I guess I was just afraid of something, or I was trying to escape from something. And you know I've never really been strong in the head. I don't want you to think it had anything to do with me being a musician. It's more than that. Or maybe less than that. I can't get anything straight in my head down here. And I try not to think about what's going to happen to me when I get out. Sometimes I think I'm just going to flip and never come out. And sometimes... I think I'll just come straight back. I tell you one thing though. I'd rather blow my brains out than go through this again. But that's what they all say. So they tell me. Give my love to Isabel and the kids. And I was sure sorry to hear about little Gracie. God. I wish I could just be like moms and say, The Lord will be done. But I don't know what. It just seems to me that the trouble is just one thing that just never gets stopped. And I don't know what good it does to be blamed by the Lord. Maybe it does do some good. If you believe it. Your brother, Sonny. I can't do the school junk. I want to be a musician. I want, I, want, I want to play piano. I can't work a nine to five for the rest of my life. It's just not me. You think you could just drop everything and just become a musician? You think it's that easy? It's hard, all right? You have to work, okay? Look, man, I know people. Trust me, I get gigs. I get gigs all the time. You gotta be lucky, man. The way life works is you go to school, you get a job, you get a family. That's what you're gonna do, all right? No. Get out of my house. Okay. I gave him the option to join the army. And the next day, I drove him down to the barracks. One day, I got a postcard from Korea, from Sonny. And he said he was well. He said he was coming back soon. And so, we planned to meet up. He said he wanted to take me to a club and play piano for me. I guess I look forward to it. <laughs> 